Hello, student. Hello. Good afternoon and welcome to Philo. Am I audible? Good afternoon. Okay. So, is this the question which you need my help? Yes. I don't understand it. Okay. <clears throat> no problem. I will help in that. So, just give me a moment. So, do you want me to explain the concept or just give you the solution for this? Um, the solution. Okay, the solution. So, find the surface area and the volume of the cement block. In the I mean... Yes. So, the first question is to find the surface area and the mm -hmm. second question is to find the volume. So, if you just look at this whole figure, you will find that mm -hmm. this is this is the length is we can say this is 19 inches, the width is 11 inches and the height is 6 inches. But this is, uh, but if you look at this top faces, so it is like that, it is not the whole. So it is, uh, this width is 5 inches, this is also 5 inches, this is also 5 inches and this is also 5 inches. And this, these two are given as 7 inches. So it means <coughs> this, this one is given as, uh, just give me a moment. This one is given as 5 inches. This one is also given as 5 inches. This one is 5 inches and this one is 5 inches. And this width is, uh, that is 7 inches. <coughs> okay. So, uh, let us understand this and uh, try to get it. How, try, try to understand this thing. Okay. So, mm -hmm. uh, in order to find the surface area first, what we are doing, we just try to find out the five faces. So this faces, this four, this five faces in on five, like total five faces, mm -hmm. uh, there is a rectangle. But on this face, faces, there is a different, different figures. So let's understand this. So do you know what is the area of a rectangle? The area of the rectangle? Um, yes. Is it length times width? Yes, length, length time width. So, if you just look at this whole diagram, whole mm -hmm. figure, so this is a rectangle face, this is also a rectangle, this one is also a rectangle, and like this one, the bottom, like the, uh, the back one is also a rectangle, mm -hmm. like this one, this is also a rectangle, and the bottom face is also a rectangle. So, it means with total we have five rectangles of different, different dimensions. So, let's find out the area of this dimension. Uh, this rectangle let me just okay this one so this one is basically the height is 6 inches and the length is 19 inches so a so area will be 19 times 6 okay mm -hmm. so, can you just tell me what is what is the value here okay hold on please sorry yes it's 114. 114. So 114 inches square. So that is that is only this part. So similarly, we have the bottom face. Like this is the front face and this so this is the back face. So the back face is also the same. So uh, it will be 144 inch square plus 144 inch square. Okay, similar to that, we have this face. So this face is basically 6 and 11. So 2 times, I am just writing 6 and 11. This this gives the area of this face and this face, this bottom, like uh, the back face. So what we are getting here, that is 66 times 2. Can you just let me know what is the, what we are getting when we multiply 6 times 11 times 2. That is 66 times 2. 66 times 2. Yes. 132. 132 inch square. Now we just got the area of these two faces and these two faces. But the base, the base area will be equals to 19 times 11. 
so the base area will be equals to uh, 19 times 11 and that is 19 times 11 so can you just calculate this it's 209 209 inches here now we just find the area of all the five faces so what are the area of the, all the five faces let me just write it here so area of five faces is equals to that is uh, <coughs> what we can see uh, let me just write it here uh, that is 209 plus 132 plus 100 okay 114 plus 140 can you just cat sorry 144 this is what would can you just calculate this Six hundred and twenty nine. Six hundred twenty nine inches square. So that is now we have this top face. In the top on the top face, we have different different shapes. Let me just uh, just try to find out. But if we just like equate all the shapes so what we are getting here uh, just give me a moment from here to from here to here so this is given one inch okay this so this is also one inch and between this and this this is five inch this is five inch and this is five inch and this is seven inch and this is one one inches so Okay, so uh, with respect to the surface area, so uh, this will be equals to, just give me a moment, equals to, uh, let me just write it here, that is whatever we are getting here, 209, uh, 629 plus 209, so what, the will, what we are getting here, that is 9 plus 9 is 18, 2 plus 4, that is 3, and 6 plus 2 is 8. So eight eight thirty eight inch square. So that is the area we are getting. Surface total area. Uh, are you able to understand? Yes, I understand. Is this the area? Is is this area is correct? Do you know the answer for this? I'm sorry. What did you say? Yes, 838 inches square. Okay. Thank you. Is it correct? Um, I think so, but. <laughs> okay. So you just enter this value here in this box and let me know. Uh, because there is an option of check answer. Okay. Yes. Hold on, I'm sorry. My internet is very slow right now. Okay. I'm doing so it on you my just laptop. Okay, you just note it down and somewhere noted noted down this answer and uh, then check them after that okay after the end of the session okay thank you okay do you have any other question no sir thank you okay thanks for connecting to you have a great day bye bye you too bye bye